I'm Laura Munoz, and welcome to Let's Talk Commercial Real Estate, a newly created video blog covering topics of interest for commercial brokers and borrowers, sponsored by American Life Financial. We'll be chatting with members of the real estate community, asking them questions that you submit on social media. Hi, I'm Laura Munoz. Welcome to Let's Talk Commercial Real Estate. Today we have Paul Wetton. Vice President of Lending at American Life Financial. Thanks for coming today, Paul. Thank you for having me. It's We're good happy to, be here. to have you. We have this driving question from the audience, and the question is Can you tell us a little bit about recourse loans versus non recourse loans? Okay, I know that there's a lot of passion around this subject, yes. so I'll try to keep it toned down here. A recourse loan is where the borrower is on the hook for the balance of a loan should the loan go into foreclosure. So in many cases, when you have a commercial loan, if there's a foreclosure and the lender sells the property later on, there's still a balance left on the loan. And so the lender would then be able to go after the borrower to collect those excess funds. Okay. A non-recourse loan is where upfront, the lender agrees that should that scenario arise where they foreclose on a property and sell it and aren't able to get enough funds to cover the loan, that they will not go after the borrower personally. They can go after the company, but not the personal assets of the people that signed the loan. And so that's the difference between okay. a recourse and a non-recourse loan. So American Life Financial seems to offer non-recourse loans. Correct. Um, any loan that is in the name of a corporation is potentially a non-recourse loan. In fact, most of the time it will be a non-recourse loan. In some cases where we might feel that there needs to be a little more security, we may require that it be a recourse loan, but that's the exception, not the rule. Okay. All right. So I have one more question. Let's uh -huh. not talk about finance for a minute. This morning, okay. I understand you taught a class. Yes. Where and what was it about? I teach a introduction to business class at Mesa Community College. Wonderful. I've been doing this for three and a half years. It's, it's fun because I'm able to take the real life experiences I have here in my, my day job, if you will, and, and talk with my students about, okay, so here's the theory and here's what it looks like in practice. And and it's it's been a great experience. I like it. I usually come back to work fairly energized because they're they're a good group of, of young people and it's it's fun to be around them. I don't feel quite as old. <laughs> so you're a professor. I am. That's fantastic. Am. Well, yes. thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you. It's we my learned pleasure. so much. I learned a lot personally and I'm sure our audience had their questions answered. Well, good. Thank Hope you. To have you back. Thank you very much. Have topics or questions you'd like covered on Let's Talk Commercial Real Estate? Or if you'd like to be a guest on Let's Talk Commercial Real Estate, please contact us at let's talk at notsohardmoney.com. Like us, follow us, and share us on social media. 